Take delight in the Lord and he will give you your heart's desires. Psalm 37, four. You haven't done this before. Ask using my name and you will receive and you will have abundant joy. John 16, 24. Dear God, I wanna look into someone's eyes and feel endless possibilities for what we can do together. I want someone who makes me wanna step up my game, be a person worthy of him and wonder what on earth I did to get to share space with him. I want someone who looks at me like I'm the only woman in the room, who when I look into his eyes, I can see deep into his soul because I am invited in, who never makes me feel insecure about his love for me, I want to laugh so hard it hurts. I want to love so hard it feels amazing and hurts simultaneously because the thought of losing that kind of love is terrifying. We will go you can turn around. As far as our feet can take us Heaven knows The world that we will find We'll paint the open sky someone who can see all sides of me and make me feel safe, loved, and protected. I want someone willing to be a partner to me, respecting me as his equal, relying on me as his support, laughing with and confiding in me as his best friend, encouraging my interests and individuality, and loving me deeply. I want someone who knows my heart and cherishes it. I want someone who will love and cherish my children as if they were his own, who will lead them, guide them, and fill in the gaps I leave open with wisdom, confidence, friendship, strength, and patience. someone who knows and loves God and is willing to create a life together that is filled with the fruits of the Spirit and dedicated to seeking God in all we do. Just a few months after I wrote that prayer, you came into my life and changed it forever. You are all of the things I prayed for and more, but most of all, you are redemption. I never thought this kind of love existed, let alone that it would find me. Your love is the most sacrificial love I have ever experienced, and being loved by you is the most amazing feeling. I'm so excited that this day is here, and that from this day forward, I get to love and be loved by you. Do life with you, my most favorite person. You and me, forever. I love you. Two years ago, I chose me. For the first time in my life, I chose to ask God who I was and who he wanted me to be. And as you heard me say, I worked my ass off to be that guy. And when I was there, I was good. And then came you, and then I wasn't good anymore. I was terrified. I asked Emily how in the world I was to give all of me to someone else and continue to give myself all that I needed. And it turns out that you gave me permission to love myself. When God brought me you, he showed me how this was to be, that the best for you would be the best version of me. And luckily you signed on before the best version of me was present because I am now far better than I was then. I am that because two are better than one. And I'm the best when I'm with you. We see it now, the story comes together. Thank you.
I've many times told you that I want to do great things. You have asserted that I'm meant to do great things beyond places like Frito and others. <laughs> and I need you to know, I believe this is the great thing God has for me. To be your husband and to be a parent and to text and Harvey. You have done a great thing in them. And I'm beyond grateful, joyful, and excited to be a part of this family. Stacia, you are my best friend. You are my better half. And I wrote this and I meant it then, but it's not even close to the right words. You're so damn hot. <laughs> and you look incredible. I love you now, and I always will. I want you to turn around for a minute. Take a look at the people that are gathered here today. By being witnesses to the vows that you make, we as your community commit to supporting you and your life together. that you are and you always will be the funniest person I know <laughs> and lastly I don't know how this river runs but I'd like the company through every twist and turn who said it's true that the growing only happens on your own they don't know me and you you don't ever have to leave if to change is what you need you can change right next to me when you're high I'll take the lows you can ebb and I can flow and we'll take it slow and grow as we go. I love you. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Nate, you may now kiss your grass. And Nate, I'd like to address you if you could stand up. Stacia, I just want you to know I'm not going to make him disappear or anything, okay? With Nate, what you see is what you get. He's really down to earth, he's humble, he's giving, and the boys really look up to him, and so do we. Pretty much everybody looks up to Nate. He's yeah. a big guy. I never, never thought I could. I couldn't imagine a better day than being right here, right now. Stacia, you are fantastic. You are a great mother and a great friend of a brother. Most importantly, the look of love and happiness I see on both of your faces as you share the story of the journey that brought you guys together. I've never wished anything for my friend Stasia other than true happiness, and I see it in her when she's with you. To Nate and Stasia, may you guys have many years of happiness and love. I love you guys. Hey.